Mungkin kita cuba lagi. Mungkin kita cuba lagi. Okay. So we continue. What area did Joseph suggest his brothers and father could live when they come to Egypt? Yes. Goshen. Okay. Whom did Joseph read over and embrace first of all? Benjamin. Among his brothers, I think that's how the question should have been. When Pharaoh found out that Joseph's brothers had arrived, he offered all of the following from Egypt, except the best of the land of Egypt that had to carry his father down to Egypt, the best of the land of Egypt, a I silver chain and a gold chain. Okay. What was Joseph, what was Jacob's first response when the brothers told him Joseph was alive in Egypt? Mm. He did not believe them. Let's read it and see. 26, verse 26 of chapter 45. What does he say? And they told him Joseph is still alive and, he's, and he is ruler of all the land of Egypt. And his heart became numb, for he did not believe them. So he did not believe them. In fact, in normal sense, it would be difficult for him to believe them. In normal sense, for so many years that this child has been nowhere. How did Joseph show his favor to Benjamin as the brothers left to return to their father, Jacob. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Oh, one more. What did you give to Benjamin? You gave Benjamin. Uh, five sets of five sets of clothes. Now, all of you are looking for the 300 shekels of silver. I've told you that always there may be two or three things. So get the two. Okay. She gave him five sets of clothes. Okay. So thank you, Mama. Let's go on to chapter 46. When Jacob set out for Egypt to meet Joseph, where did he stop and offer a sacrifice? Where? Okay. When Jacob set out from Egypt, okay, when Jacob set out for Egypt, God told Jacob in a dream what will happen to his family in Egypt. They'll become a great nation. He said they will become a great, great nation. Good. Who was Jacob's firstborn? Oh, Adiwi. Robin. All of the following were sons of Judah, except. Wow. Zephon. I think we have done this one already. The question has been repeated. Who was the mother of Dinah? Okay. Yeah. 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 Zilpa was whose handmaid? Leah. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Who were the two sons born to Rahel? Joseph and Benjamin. Joseph and Benjamin. Okay. All of the following were Levi's sons, except as an M. Mattis said about Jali Jali Jali. So we did a fair way Rasta for the J. A. H. Nia Ja. So Lee J. 
Jali. Ananyera Zavone Kaja Rastafara. Who were the two sons of jo Joseph born in Egypt? Ephraim and Manasseh. Okay. How many descendants of Jacob were in Egypt when he came to meet Joseph? How many descendants of Jacob were in Egypt when he came to meet Joseph? Is that it's 70. So let's read the verse. Um, um, mm, there were 70 of them. So let's read it and see. Chapter 47, verse 27. 27. Two sons were born to Joseph in Egypt, bringing to 70 the total number of Jacob's family who went there. So, how many people went there? 70. But how what do we people? get the 66? So, but, um, the verse 26. The verse 26. Uh, it said the total number of the direct descendants of Jacob who went to Egypt was 26, not including his son's wife. Okay. So, they gave the not including. Not including, yeah. Yes. And here they are saying, how many descendants of Jacob were in Egypt? I don't know whether you get it. But this yes. one is telling when those came... who set off. The six days were those who set off. I mean, this was not including Jacob's son's wives. So still, I think uh, the number isn't correct. Okay. Hello. 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 Please, can you hear me? Can you hear us? Oh, am I on? Yes, yes sir. Sir. Okay, so. So that gives us was the sovereignty. Where did Joseph end up settling his father and family in Egypt, where? Goshen. Goshen. Okay. Goshen. What occupation was detestable to the Egyptians? I can't even Oh, this one, you should know it because the Israelites were Joseph's wife was the daughter of because we only see Asia. Yes, was the daughter of you said Athana Potiphar, the captain of Pharaoh's guy. The Pharaoh, the, the priest of On. Hello. Yes. Hello, Papa. The priest, the priest of, of On. On. That is it. We realized it even earlier. When we got to know the name, and what's the name of Joseph's wife? Because that question had come early. Asana. Okay, good. Genesis chapter 47. What did Pharaoh ask Joseph's brothers? According to verse 3, what did he ask Joseph's brothers? Mm -hmm. He asked of the yeah. occupation. He asked of the occupation. Okay. Where did the brothers request of Pharaoh to settle in Egypt? Where did the brothers request of Pharaoh to settle in Egypt? Question. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Are you sure? Can, can... But I don't know. Are you sure? Anyway, it's gushing. I just wanted to be sure. 
What did the what did Pharaoh ask Jacob? According to verse eight. Uh, he has of the age. age. What did Jacob do for Pharaoh when they were introduced? He blessed Pharaoh. Great. He blessed. Okay. Yeah. How old was Jacob when he met Pharaoh? 130. 130. Mm -hmm. Papa, when you so be do cry Into what district in Gershon did Pharaoh direct Jacob? Mm -hmm. Ramesses. Okay. Ramesses. Okay. After the people of Egypt ran out of money, what did Joseph require of them to purchase grain? He said, Livestock. That's sheep, goats, and cattle. Okay, so livestock. What was the last payment Joseph accepted of the people of Egypt in order to buy grain? Uh, <laughs> livestock. Are you sure? Hello. Mama, are you sure? They are bodies and lands. Okay, we did the less. Lands. We did the less all year. Okay, verse 18. Mm -hmm. The following year, they came to him and said, mm -hmm. We will not hide the fact that. Uh, the fact from you said that our money is all gone and our livestock belongs to you. There is nothing left to give you except our bodies and our lands. Mm -hmm. So that was the last so offer. Now, after first it was money, money got finished, then they brought their livestock, it got finished, now they were left with their body and land. Whose land did Joseph not buy with the green? Yes. Whose land did Joseph not buy with the grain? The, the land which belongs to the priest. The, priest. the land which belongs to the priest. How much of a tax did Joseph put on the people that was still that was still in place when Jim? One, one of the land. What did the Israelite do in Gershom? What did they do according to verse 27? The increase in number. The increase in number. As Jacob approached his death, how did he make Joseph promise? Mm -hmm. Put his hand under his thigh. Okay, to put his hand under his thigh. What did Joseph promise Jacob just before he died? According to the verse 13. Bury him with his fathers in Canaan. Okay. How many years did Jacob live in Egypt? 17. So Jacob lived in Egypt for 17 years. 17. When Jacob's brothers, so that means that when Jacob died, how old was he? If he lived in Egypt, 147. 147. Why did he arrive at the 147? The, the 130. Okay. When Jacob's when brothers, had, okay. When Jacob's when arrived, brothers, it was one day when he arrived. Okay. When Jacob's brothers announced that they were shepherds, what was Pharaoh's response? Mm -hmm. 
they should be overseers of his livestock. Okay. Chapter 48. So we'll be finishing very soon. I'll leave it two more just to go. When Joseph found out his father was ill in Egypt, who did he take with him to pay a final visit? Two sons. Okay. I'm sure when our old people are saying we don't send our children to them, we have already we imparted their witchcraft onto our children. <laughs> but he took it to them. What was the name of Joseph's oldest son? Manasi. Manasi. Isn't it a frame? No. Manasi. What was the name? What is the name of Joseph's second, second oldest son? Ephraim. Mm -hmm. Okay. When Jacob was reciting his spiritual journey, journey to Joseph in Egypt, he said God had appeared to that which he named it. He said, Lose. When Jacob was reciting his spiritual journey to Jacob and uh, Joseph in Egypt, he told Joseph that God had he told Joseph that God had blessed him with all of the following, except what? According to the verse four, God had blessed him with all the following except what? Mm -hmm. A is the land will be an everlasting uh, possession. B is that you will be buried in the land of his fathers. C is that you will be buried in the land of his fathers. D is that you will be made into a company. So it's a that you will be buried in the land of his fathers. When Jacob talked to Joseph when he was ill, he said, what of Joseph's two sons? They would be... They will be what? They will be as his as own sons. His own sons. So that is why when we were discussing the Old Testament survey, you realize that when we got to the 12 tribes of... Um, the twelve tribes of Egypt and uh, of Israel. I told you that out of the twelve children, it was only ten who were founders of the tribes, the twelve tribes. Levi and Joseph were not part. However, it was twelve tribes because the two were replaced with what Ephraim and Manasseh. Mm -hmm. So we have the tribe of Ephraim, we have the tribe of Manasseh, but put together belongs to what? Joseph. Okay. So let's continue. When Jacob talked to Joseph, when he was ill, he said Rahel had been buried near Bethlehem, which, is, which he called Ephraim. Ephraim. Ephraim, that was it. Okay. Okay, so when Joseph took his sons to Jacob for the blessing, which son did Jacob, which son did Joseph put on Jacob's left hand? And this Manasseh. Is Manasseh. Ooh, Manasseh. Why do you think Manasseh was not put there, but it was rather Ephraim was put there? Because Ephraim was the youngest, so... So it, the youngest was put on the left hand, and then the yeah. eldest, who was Manasseh, was put on the right hand. Mm. Do you understand? Anyway, we'll get to know how... He, when Joseph took his sons to Jacob for the blessing, which son did he actually put on his left hand? Oh, I think we have talked about... We have talked about this one. Mm. 
Okay, so the next question. When Jacob was blessing Joseph, he said he had taken the rich land from what group of people? The Amorites. Okay, the Amorites. With what two instruments did Jacob say he had taken the rich country in Canaan? Mm. There were two instruments you mentioned. Yes, verse 22 of chapter 48. Yes. Okay, so sword and bow. Chapter 49. When Jacob called his sons together to bless them in Egypt, he said he would tell them, mm, what did he say you would tell them? Mm. What blessings each? No. no, 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 no. Not, oh, okay. <laughs> so, excuse me, sorry. He said you would tell them what? What will happen in the last days? You said? What will happen in the days to come? Yes, what will happen in the days to come? Is it not a prophecy? Mm -hmm. So that is he a prophet to tell what is to happen in the days to come? In Jacob's blessing, he said Reuben would no longer excel because of what? Because he defiled his father's bed. So that means that he knew that Reuben slept with who? Who, who did Reuben sleep with? Yes, one of the yeah. concubines. Yesterday we talked about who did he sleep with? Yes. Zopa. Zopa. What was the future that was to come on Levi and Simeon? What was the future that was to come on Levi and Simeon? They would, buy, they would die by the sword. Why? Probably because mm -hmm. they went ahead to slaughter a man of Sechem. Very good. By, by the sword. Yes. Levi and Simeon received their blessing. Okay, we answered it. We answered it. They were what weapons of violence. Okay. Which of the 12 brothers was said by Jacob to be to be a lion's cub? Judah. Okay. So that's why we say the lion of who? The Judah. tribe. The lion of the tribe of Judah. To which tribe did Jacob say the spectre? would not depart until he comes to whom it belongs. Judah. Is that it? Judah. God. Judah. Judah or God? Judah. Judah. Okay. Correct. Which of the brothers will live by the seashore towards Sidon? Zebulun. Okay. Zebulun. Which tribe did Jacob say would submit to for to forced labor like a donkey between the between two sander southern bags? Mm -hmm. Zaka. Okay. Zaka. Which tribe did Jacob say would provide justice for Israel? Asha. Dan. 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 
Okay, done. Where? This thing moves faster. Which brother did Jacob say would be a fruitful, a fruitful vine? A fruitful vine. Which of them? Joseph. Joseph. Okay. In Jacob's. In Jacob's blessing of Joseph, he referred to God in all of the following ways, except the rock of Israel. Except the rock of Israel. Are you sure? The God of Abraham. Let's read it and see. What wow. did he say? Yes, let's read and see. Okay. So 49, chapter 49, verse 24. What does he say? 24 of chapter. Yet his bow remained unmoved. His arms were made again by the hands of the almighty God of Jacob. From there, from there is the shepherd, the stone of Israel. By the God of your father, who will, who will help you? By the God Almighty who will bless you with blessing of heaven, blessing of the DC, the God, by the God of your fathers, Abraham, from the father Abraham. Okay. Mm -hmm. So all the things were said, except the father of Abraham in the verse nine. Who did Jacob call? A ravenous wolf. Mm -hmm. Benjamin. Benjamin. So please, some of these things, let's note them all. This is one of the things I can. But let's note them. Jacob requested that his sons bury him in the cave of that that Abraham bought in Cana. What was the cave? From the Hittite. Okay, so if you remember, we talk about Abraham buying the uh, cave of Ephron from the Hittite vicinity. The field where Jacob desired to be buried was called what? Machpelah. Machpelah. Okay, you see, we have met it again. <laughs> the cave where Jacob desired to be buried was located by what town in Cana? Mamre. Mamre. Okay. When Jacob died, to whom was he guarded? Mm -hmm. Children. His, 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 his people. His people. Okay. His people. Which of the brothers did Jacob say would be a viper along the path? Dan. Okay. So finally, chapter 50. When Jacob died, how did Joseph prepare him for burial? He embalmed him. Yes, yeah, so I tell people that the embalmment is also part of the, what is being done in the Bible. So when someone died, they want to do it. Don't be so like mempene, mempene. Yes, you can say. Yes, you can say. Yes, who did Joseph ask for permission to go and bury his father in Cana? When they returned to bury Jacob in Cana, who what stayed in Geshom? Their children and heights. They are what? Children, children on the heads. On the return to Cana to bury Jacob, where did they stop seven days to mourn his dead? 
in the in the world of Bersva. That no, the trash the the world of us. Now, so when someone died and then the person said, I don't want to be buried in another place, send me back to my hometown. We have been talking, but it's the same thing that happened. So you wanted to be buried back at where the promised land. In what cave was Jacob buried? Makala. So do you need more? Near what village is the cave where Jacob was buried? As I'm pretty. Wow. Petla. Are you sure? Petla. Mamre. Very good, Mama. Mamre. Mama. What name? Yes, so correct. What <laughs> name was given to the place where jo Joseph worked for Jacob? <clears throat> he was returned to Cana by the Jordan. <laughs> What name was given to that place? Verse 11. Yes. Abel, I am. 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 After the death of Jacob, Joseph's brother said that Jacob had requested what of Joseph? Forgiveness. According to verse 17. He said, oh, Abraham, forgiveness. forgiveness. When Jacob's, uh, when Joseph's brothers approached him after Jacob died, Joseph said, what did God intend for good? Joseph said, what did God intend for good? The harm they intended. The harm they intended was not meant for good. When Joseph was about to die, what did he tell his brothers? Mm. What did he tell his brothers? They should not fight among themselves. So they will they return will to the promised to land. Wow. What oath did Joseph make his brothers swear upon his dead bed? His bones out of Egypt. Yeah, carry his bones out of Egypt. Okay. How many years old was Joseph when he died? One ten. Okay. After Joseph was embarked in Egypt, where was his body placed? Coffin. Coffin. In a coffin. Okay. Who originally sold the cave where Jacob was buried to Abraham? Back to back question. If from the Hittite. Okay. Whose children did Joseph see to the third generation? Mm. Ephraim. We are sure now which will be. But which one? <laughs> sure, Papa, but... Whose children were placed on Joseph's knees at his at their birth? The children of Maka. Man Manasseh. The children of Manasseh. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So we bring her to the end of Genesis. Um, like we'll start with the Exodus, but let's rest and go to Exodus tomorrow so that we start a new one, a new page on it. The question, any question?
So thank you all, and may the good Lord see you all to all of us. It will be well with us. Thank you. God bless you. Bye bye. 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 Bye.